this is okay. so is this is uh, for the author of a book. Yeah. Oh, who needs the pet? It's this book. So we're going to a party to with this guy. Yeah. And he's gonna. Like, who needs the Fed? Hold that up to the camera so people can see it. Who needs the Fed? Or Taylor Swift, Uber, and robots tell us about money, credit, why we should abolish American Central Bank. Beautiful. Okay. <laughs> yes, I love so, it. That's beautiful. That's where's where's, where's this, this being bigger. held? Where's this it's being held? Oh, no. yeah. well, that's where you're from. Yeah. yeah. Wonderful. So it's, it's not convenient for you. Well, but, but it, it's nice to know these things are going yeah. on, let other people know they're going on. Right, so I was going to bring him a sticker. No, yeah, why not? Okay. Yeah, sure. So if you have... Yeah, I got that one. Yeah. But yes. I can't, I can't. Uh, What do you do there? What do you do in Philadelphia? See, I'm, I work in the banking business. That's why I can't really? have the as the rest of the banksters, because that's me. That's what me. what bank do you work for? I used to work for Morgan Stanley. I'm actually retired. Uh-huh. But I still would not like to be a <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm going to give you my card and go to my YouTube channel. Okay, cool. I had the occasion to talk to a lady who was the wife of, of a Treasury Department uh -huh. bank examiner. Okay. This is what she told me. Yeah, so I, you know, this is what her husband was trying to convince her that they need to do. Yeah. He says he hasn't found a solvent bank yet. And that, that, that America is going through hell in a handbag. See, that's soon. why you don't flip your money in banks. Okay? And I didn't really work for it. Morgan Stanley's bank now, but when I worked for it, it wasn't a bank. It's, um, I, I uh, ran one of their mutual funds. And mutual funds are solvent. Mutual so, funds yes. are solvent? If you were worried about solvency, you should put your money in mutual funds. Not well, in I'm worried about what the whole. See, banks, banks will never. It, Have you ever Mutual heard? Mutual funds—they take your money and they don't—they they don't do anything you, with but, it. But how soon? Now you know the the Bilderbergs are meeting right now. Yes. Okay. What's on the plate? What do you think is on the plate right now? They're talking about them managing the economic collapse, the world well, economic collapse. Right. That's yeah. what's on the menu there right now. Do you is think? It? Yes. Yeah. Well, I think they're a little bit the British. Yeah. yeah. How do you feel the about the, the 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 Brexit? I would be inclined to vote for it, but yeah, well, it's because probably you're, going to be a disaster. Because you're a bankster. <laughs> no, no, I'd vote, to, I'd vote to exit. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. oh good. God bless you. I'd All right. Yeah. yeah I'd vote for Brexit. That's what I meant. For Brexit. Thank you. But thank you. Yes. God bless you. That's good. I don't yeah. think it's going to happen. You, you don't think? Well, today it, it, it was they have a 10-point lead for like exit. Yeah. There was a surge in, in, like, let's get out of here. Yeah. yeah. I, you know, I think if, if they vote for Brexit, uh, more than they vote now. But I don't actually think it's bad. Oh, you know? well, no, we need a correction. It's just that how much of a correction on them. If, if the, if the Cretans at the top go for broke, and 90% of us are just going to suffer bad. I just think that if the UK leaves, nothing bad is. Markets agree with that, but the problem is they say, well, if the UK leaves, then what about you know this country and that country? And somebody said, well, France might want to leave. That's not going to happen. The e I mean, the EU is France. And Germany. Without France and Germany, it does not exist. So the whole scare story is, well, what if France and Germany break apart and they have another war? That's that's the reason to be afraid. I think it's really far fetched. I think if they really I just the read Paul Craig Roberts. You're familiar with Dr. Paul Craig Roberts. And he had a, I just read his article this morning, and of course he is like a dark soldier now. All he sees is dark cloud. And he said he doesn't see any sanity at all in our leadership. But things are going to hell. I mean, you know. They were going to hell 50 years ago. You're just yeah, but, but, yeah, but you know, we should get closer and closer to that cliff. Yeah. It's like, you know, we're you at the cliff now. So gold, good bet. I don't know. Yourself, I already gave you a tip.
I'm a software guy. Oh, yeah, they back yeah. back yeah. computers. Yeah. We, we had to have a 60 percent out of work if it wasn't right. the computers. Yeah, we got plenty of jobs there. All right. All right, thanks. Yeah, nice